What's up you guys? Welcome back to our dumpster diving channel. It is the first of the month today, so welcome to April. We are so excited to go out and dive in some apartment complexes. The beginning of the month and the end of the month are great times to come out and check, especially residential areas because lots of people are moving in and out and so they're throwing lots of things away. So hopefully that will be true for today and we'll find lots of stuff. So we're at the first spot uh, and I already took a peek. I don't really think there's much, but let's check and then we'll keep diving at apartments. All right, first one. This is the one I said. I'm not sure, but we'll check it anyways. Let's see. <laughs> what you looking for? How many, how many more of these are Hello Fresh ice packs? <laughs> <laughs> that one's still, uh, you frozen. can see it's frozen. The ones that we did take home, uh, they froze right back in the freezer, so that's pretty cool. All right, I'm not seeing anything. Yeah, there's a lot of food trash in there. Okay, you guys, we are headed to the next spot. Next dumpster, let's see. Oof, that one smells kind of bad. Mm. Ooh, roaches. <laughs> Okay, gross one. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> it's like no different. It's lounge chairs. <laughs> no, this one has, this one's pretty gross. Yeah. Oh, someone got that giant parrot cage. All right, all the stuff's gone. All the stuff's gone. That's Yeah, that's awesome. Cool. Moving on. Okay. What are we dealing got with? A pretty much empty one. Pretty much a lot of trash. Okay. Man, it is a nice day. I really thought it was going to be colder. No, oh, it's like such a nice spring day. seeing a lot of trash. These aren't as full as I was expecting. No, people aren't really moving out, I guess. <laughs> Everyone's <laughs> staying. <laughs> Everyone loves it here. <laughs> All right. Another apartment. Oof. It's just fit anything at all. Mm. Okay. All right. Do you want to switch and go to retail? Maybe we should like head that way and we can okay. stop if we see anything. But... Well, we're not having much luck uh, at the apartments and last week we weren't having much luck at retail and so we switched to apartments and it worked out really well. So today we're not having luck at apartments. We're going to switch and try to dive at some retail shops and see if we have some better luck there. So we're going to head uh, over to that side of town. Here we go. We are at some retail shops now. It is a beautiful sunny day. I hope it's beautiful where y'all are. Let's see. Okay, that's something. There's some stuff. We might, <laughs> we might have made um, a good call here. We have struggled with that in the past because we're like, we should just keep going. Like, we'll find something. And we've started trying to make uh, more just like, okay, we're not finding a lot. Let's switch it up. Let's try something different. And it has been working out for us. What am I reaching? For? So let's see, there's a Theo. I think it says, there's that, and then I see those metal things. Oh yeah, it's like a little bathroom. Huh, there's some stuff all over it. But do you see that bag? It looks like a coffee bag or something. Uh-huh. Those are the chocolates Organic we like. peppermint crunch cookie bites. Yeah, <laughs> I think that whole bag might be stuff, maybe. Oh, it's a tiny little bag. <laughs> That's a passport cover. Okay. <laughs> nice. That's a little box. Um, huh, they're open. Shit. Oh, what'd you find? Let's 
some wood letters. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we dive, you guys. This is why. We told you there was good stuff out here. <laughs> It's weird that these chocolates. Yeah, oh, these chocolates are opened. Oh. See the seal on them is. Oh yeah, they've been opened. Yeah. yeah. Dump them like all these. Whoa. They did dump all those chocolates out. Oh, someone's right there. Well, do you want to move on? Well, we did kind of grab our stuff. Yeah. Not really anything else in there. There we go. We'll take it. Yeah. I'm gonna get a bag out of here real quick. keep going to retail shops so we're moving on new spot whoa they got their candles candles <laughs> this guy's back story oh, oh. signs <laughs> we could use them at garage sales <laughs> grab a couple of them that's actually kind of cool fun for garage sales. They don't say five below or anything on them, so. <laughs> Do you hear your head? <laughs> oh my gosh, there's so many of them. Of the signs? Yes! <laughs> This is a lot of plastic. Huh. See? Oh, wow. Here, maybe hold this and I'll dig a bit. This is like, oh, look, there's some little tiny ones. We might want to take some small ones. Those might even be more useful. These are still in the 450, <laughs> if we want to get specific. <laughs> Cents. Let's take that one too. I know this is kind of weird, but it would help us. Cents. <laughs> Do we need some three dollar twenty five cents? I don't think so. Right. That was specific. Oh my gosh, there's a bunch more. Well, alrighty. There we go. We did get some of those little signs. I really think those would be great at a garage sale. It saves you having to write out every individual price and you can just like have a whole table of $5 items, $3 items. I think that's gonna be cool. So good stop. We are moving on. All right. This right here is a pet store and the dumpster's technically locked, but like you can just open it. Oh, but look. That is so clean. Oh, wow. Yeah. No luck there. Okay. There we go. Nothing at all. We thought we might be able to find bones, something. But we're going to check pet stores uh, more frequently now. So nothing here. So we are moving on. Oh, no. 
document. Oh, yeah, birds of prey document. Welcome to Nat Geo. That's right. Trash. And more trash. Trash, trash, and more trash. Yep. All right. Well, what are we doing? Moving on. Oh, we're, we're moving on right <laughs> Nothing in it. Oh, it smells strong. All right, fellow dumpster diver. <laughs> Where right. do you think we're going to end up looking? I think we're going to end up looking right in this one, and I think it's going to have some good stuff in it. Pretty much it's going to have everything we've been wanting. It's going to be full of diamonds. <laughs> yeah, you did want to find a bag of diamonds. This isn't anything. <laughs> Nothing in this Nothing. one. Nothing. Why do we even do it? <laughs> Why do we do it? Why do we do it? <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's try this side. All right, that is a big bag of plastic in there. All right, recycling. Check this one. Oh, there's a great, or a, what's that called? A... Oh, look, that's, yeah, that's great. We could even use this, well, bones could fit right through there. But yeah. There we go. Someone will definitely be able to use that. Well, we got a little, this is from a baby and children's resale store. So I assume that's for children, um, maybe to put in front of the door or the stairs. Uh, so there we go. A little find right there and we're moving on. All right, let's see. Um, okay, there's some food right there. Uh, a lot of cans in here look like they've been emptied out. There's some cereal in the corner. Don't, don't have to... Like they'd been opened. Not all, but that one's not busted. Like huh? Oh, it's like the crates. Yeah, it's, not, it's the crate broke and these oh. are all so Oh, oh, I'll get a view. Yeah. bent up and uh, bent, but they are uh, not opened. Oh, 
bad. Let's put it down here and look through it. Yeah, it's kind of maybe like the last. Huh, that's something. Oh, gross. Okay, that's, that's not right. Broken nail polishes in here. Broken. Oh, that one's leaking. <laughs> oh, yeah, it is. is that laundry detergent in there? Yeah. Oh, nice. It's leaking a little. that were in there and they just got kind of beat up Sometimes. Ooh, the bottom's not all the way shut oh my gosh. there we go we're gonna have yeah. to move this and just <laughs> individually get them out at home all right so we'll wash these up and these are great to be donated we don't really drink a lot of soda, so those really will all just go to the little free pantry once we get them washed up because they're very sticky right now. So, all right, not a bad stop. Going to the next one. All right, it's a new spot. Let's see what we got. Hey. Oh, wow. Lots of weird stuff. Whoa. Oh, I thought it was like a cane. It's a tripod. Oh, yeah, it is. Huh. I'm gonna hook this up. That's cute. Cool. 
Huh. We could wear uh, buns on it. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking it's for, well, I guess it's... 21 pounds. Yeah, it is for like it's smaller. I mean, it's, I don't know if we need to take that, but we can if you want. Uh, it doesn't have to take it. Yeah, it's pretty busted too. I got like, you know, with these. Oh yeah, garage sale, that's great. Sheets. Actually, we need those. That's great. We don't need a pre cut, I guess. Here, you want to keep using that? Oh, there's a. Another one of these. scented ammonia. I mean, I guess that's good to have for cleaning, but it's also scary, I feel like. It's just cleaning supplies. That's true. Okay. Don't mix it. Well, there we go. And we got all the pieces for this cute little multicolored storage thing. We got some great stuff here. We've needed one of these spray bottles uh, for cleaning and stuff, so that's great. There's that under there, and we got all these arugula plants too. We got a few of them. Um, all right. Oh, more ammonia. Well, that's a bucket. Probably a good little like yeah. cleaning bucket or something. Mm -hmm. 
shine the screen. I was wondering what that said. Is it huge? Yeah, it's like too big to even get to. Oh yeah, it's like got chickens on oh, it. It's just Traeger, which is like a oh. real thing. Alrighty, there we go. Not bad. We've been out here like all day. We're just now starting to find stuff. So that's great. There's a, the rest of the little thing. Did you get the grabber back? Yeah. All right, there's the dumpster. Great, that is an awesome stop. We've got the thrift store right up here. So let's head that way. It's like a giant <laughs> scrub daddy. Oh, there's that, that's fun. That can be cleaned up. <laughs> oh wow. That's heavy elements. I wonder why they threw this way. Oh, maybe her, well, there's something missing, I guess. They or her halo's bent, but it's still pretty. Take that. Hey, a tennis racket. Yeah, a couple strings are broken. Oh, um, yeah, you're right. Like, I know you can restring them, but I don't know how. Yeah. <laughs> and I don't know if, like, I don't think this is a nice tennis racket. Yeah. Uh, strings probably be expensive. Oh, there's a big dinosaur or something. <laughs> That's funny. Pain-free, stress-free living. Oh, is it to like stress right I there? guess. Hey, there was something cool under there. There's a wooden thing with stars on it. Oh, ah! right now. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> a giant paper mache boot. <laughs> it looks it. like it's from a Ronald McDonald statue. Yeah, that's funny. Oh, Here, push it. this thing out. Yeah, we definitely gotta take it. There, it popped right out. And then I saw here, can I borrow the grabber real quick? It just looks like. Oh, well, one. That's a pretty little tray, but this right here, what is this? <laughs> okay, <laughs> not that. <laughs> <There's> that. <laughs> this. Look how pretty. I love the stars are so like mid century, but what is it? I can't tell. Tiny little table. <laughs> I know. I'm gonna hold on to it for a second. Oh, that hot dog. Yeah, the hot dog. You gotta get the hot dog. Yeah. <laughs> it's a <laughs> to wash yeah, it up but look oh he's gonna be a little hot dog he's gonna hate it <laughs> <laughs> we'll leave it on him for 20 seconds <laughs> oh you were on this side though you want to switch back or are you good i don't know i had not really there's some little bolts i saw but
take this bag out and see what else is in here. So this is clothes. I think I might take the jewelry at the Ooh. bottom. And then this is actually a really nice bag. Let's put this back here. It is the next day. When we got back from diving yesterday, we had a lot of work to do, and this week has been so busy for us with getting bones and restocking the website, which thank you guys so, so much for shopping. A lot of you came and bought our dumpster finds, and we just really, really appreciate all of the love and support from you guys. So thank you to everyone who shopped. There are still new items up there. You can still shop. The link to our website is in the description of this video. And now let's uh, look through the stuff that we found today. So I'm actually gonna take it out of the bed of the truck because it is still just back here right now. So I'm gonna lay some stuff out on the table. We had a mystery bag that I'll go through and lay that out on the table. So really, really awesome haul. Uh, I'm excited to see more of this. You know, one thing I will show you in the truck bed here uh, are the cans again, because I'm not gonna take all these inside right now. It's actually about to storm. Um, so I'm just gonna lay them all out in the driveway and let the rain wash the stickiness off because it's gonna rain today and tomorrow but there's the cans so that's awesome those will be donated to the free pantry and then the rest of this stuff uh, let me lay it out on the table and I will show y'all okay it is all laid out on the table behind me so let me show you guys there we go <laughs> This was an awesome haul. I am gonna start over here and end with the best stuff. So we got these, these are from Five Below and they're to help price things in the store. Uh, they threw them all away and I actually think they'd be great for garage sales. There's 99 cents, 89 cents. We can just have like tables that are specific prices. The ones with quarters are kind of weird. Uh, but there we go, 350. There's a bunch of prices on there. So I'm excited about those. And there's little small ones here as well. $5 or two for three, which those are great for garage sales. So there we go. There's those. We got one D, just a craft. These are pre-cut parchment sheets. Really convenient. We've needed some parchment sheets. These are unopened. Under that, one little uh, poly portfolio, it's called. Just a school supply. In this little basket, this is a little like shower caddy. There's some C's to go with the D there. We got one passport cover still in the packaging. Two butterflies, they're just loose. They could go maybe in a crafting bundle and some uh, gift bags right here. And then these are the little food items that we found. 
So there's some cereals uh, and the shower caddy, and then there's also for the bath, this one uh, little toothbrush holder. It's missing the cup on the other side, but that's easily replaceable. She was beautiful, and I was able to just bend that halo right back. So the only thing wrong with it now, which you can't even tell from the front, but the only thing wrong with it is I see now that she had wings. And so the wings were right there, and they're not there anymore. Uh, but look at her. She's beautiful. Uh, it's an element. So there we go. I'm glad the halo bent right back. I think she's beautiful. So there's that. We got this little beer uh, koozie. That's cute. It's got like, it's like it's in a little uh, scuba diving outfit. <laughs> there's that little wetsuit. And then these are both from the Dollar Tree. They're really cute. They're uh, just these cheetah print bags. They are like this material. It's kind of waterproof feeling. Uh, it probably says it on here. <laughs> so yeah, they're really cute. Uh, those are great items, brand new with the tags. We have these uh, egg rings. They make eggs perfectly. This I was curious about, and now that I looked it up, I'm excited. It is an acupuncture pillow. So you roll on it with your neck. It kind of hurts me even right now just holding it. Uh, so there we go. It's an acupuncture pressure pillow. So really cool. When I looked up, they actually come with a mat as well, but we only have the pillow right there. And then all this stuff here, aside from this big paper mache boot, which we're just, I, I mean, it's so cool. I love it. It's so like folk art-y. So there it is. <laughs> All of this stuff now left uh, was from this bag, which this was just a purse that the thrift store had thrown away. All of its um, things, all of the things it contained as well. It just threw out the purse with everything in it. And we grabbed it and I'm really glad that we did because look at all of this stuff. I think that they wanted to donate this stuff uh, in the thrift store, I don't know, didn't want to go through it, so they threw it away. So here's what we're looking at. We've got a lot of phone cases and a lot of watch repair. These are like bags of new bands. Uh, and yeah, this one was still in the box, stainless steel watch band. It's got all the pieces you need to work on it. Here's another one. Uh, and then these are phone cases. This one's a magnetic phone case. And then these are all really unique. Uh, they're really interesting. Wild, that one says. And this one here. Yeah, so, and then this box had a phone case in it. I think this case was in it, um, but it has two glass screen protectors in there and then the wipes so that you can like really clean your screen and everything before so that it sticks. And they were in this box. Uh, so maybe they did repairs on stuff. I'm not sure, maybe they just liked changing it up. Uh, there was also an HDMI cord, which is just always great to have. We literally have so many of them because we find them so often. And this is an Aleve, I'm gonna guess some type of topical pain reliever. I don't know if it like vibrates or what it does. The batteries are dead. So there's that. It's I guess it's a medical thing of some kind. Uh, and we'll see what it does. I'll look that up. So this was also still uh, from the same bag. There are a couple chain extenders here for necklaces. There's two more. And we got these really nice pins. This is like the first thing I pulled out of the bag and I'm really excited about them. They just look pretty. They look nice to write with. Uh, so, oh look, oh my God, they're stylus pins. They're for your phone. Oh, that's cool. I love doing like Instagram stories uh, and I try to write with my finger a lot of the times and it just does not work. Y'all probably know, like when you try to write with your finger like that, it just doesn't look like your handwriting. And so these styluses, uh, they might actually work on my phone. So that would be really cool. Then we also got these stickers. There's three of these Harley Davidson flags and three of this Yak Fishing Crew. 940 is the area code here. Uh, so that's probably just a local club. Then there are these thank you cards, just a few of them. They're little small ones, but that's nice. And they came with the envelopes. Two more stickers here. There we go. And this cute bottle opener. That's really, really cute. This is a just legal pad. 
but it's post-its on the back, which is great. Then right here we have one little keychain. It's kind of cheapy, but you know, there's a little keychain. And this is for a gun. This is to, I don't know, change the color of it, I guess, because that's green. Uh, but yeah, it shows you there how to put it on. So that could be a, a garage sale or maybe eBay item uh, or something like that. And then these were just little miscellaneous Halloween things. They were all in this one bag, but I don't want to throw them away. I think I'll just uh, put them with some of our other little guys that we've collected. Oh, and then this I didn't show. I still do not know what it's for, but I really, really love it. Um, it has these nice stars on it. It looks really like mid-century to me. And then the back has little stands. So it does stand up like that, uh, but you can also, I found this out, you can just twist these off and then they, uh, it could lay flush against a wall. And I actually think it would look cool like that. Like if it was just, you know, on the wall like that, you could put a picture in the center of it, or you could just leave it up like that if you had other stuff on the wall. So there's that. Really, really pretty. I like it. I'm going to try to figure out some way to use it in the house. So that is our haul. Uh, we also, oops, a couple more things. This was um, the rest of the stuff in the bag of donations. It's just clothes in here. This is a dog sweater. Uh, and then the rest is mainly t-shirts and bathing suits. And then we got two costumes, which I haven't washed it. You can see there's like some fur uh, and lint and stuff on it. But these are two little costumes and I'm gonna see if Bones, he's sleeping in the window right now. I'm gonna see if he would wear it just for like one minute so I could take a little picture of him with it. So cute, so I'm gonna wash those. And that is this haul. So there we go, you guys. That is this dumpster diving video. Thank you so much for watching. We kind of wanted to give up there for a little bit. We weren't finding really anything, but I'm glad that we kept going. We ended up with an amazing haul here and being able to pull something out of the dumpster and rescue it from the landfill that was donated to a thrift store feels really good. Like that person went and tried to do something good by donating these items and they ended up, you know, being sent to the landfill without this person ever knowing that that's where these items that they donated, intentionally went and donated, uh, were gonna end up. And so I'm really glad that we just happened to be there at that time on that specific day so that we could rescue those items and get them to new homes. So thank you guys again for watching. And I also want to thank everybody who has shopped our dumpster finds. It really means so much to us uh, that you guys like this channel, that you guys like us and our dumpster diving and that you want to support us and you want to keep things out of the landfill. So we just really appreciate you guys. Thank you for watching. There's little baby bones in the background just being adorable. I did end up caving and making him an Instagram. So if you want to follow Bones, his Instagram is catbonesworms. <laughs> It's like I worked so hard to try to come up with a Instagram name that was just his name and I couldn't. So I'm using more of the reference of why we even named him Bones, which is from I Think You Should Leave, which is like our favorite TV show. So we're going with Cat Bones Worms. You can follow him on Instagram if you wanna see more cute videos, more little pictures of him just doing his little cat thing. So thank you guys again. We will be back with more dumpster diving very soon. So we will see y'all then. Thanks for watching, bye.